2020. Today is my birthday. And I decided to spend it to conduct a relief operation to those affected by the eruption of the Al Volcano. Hey guys, ito po yung Al Volcano ngayon. So, pupunta tayo sa mga communities. Today, it's a special day today and let's please pray na sana po kumalma na siya. Ayan siya. Kung nakikita nyo, nag-split pa siya ng cash and anytime, pwede siya pumutok. So, just in case, we are prepared. So, let's go! With my heart filled with inspiration, sharing the blessings that God has showered me with, that in this uh, little efforts initiated along with the brave members of today's relief operations, we have shared our little part in keeping them positive. Then and there we planned our system of distribution. First up, was along the road near Palace in the Sky, where more than a dozen of locals immediately rushed to our cars the moment they saw us loaded with goods. At that moment, we got everything planned out. The lead car paved the way to try keep everyone organized before we opened the third car where, well, I was waiting at the back and ready to distribute the goods. They're accepting anything that comes along the way, food, hygiene kits, blankets, and jackets, to aid them in surviving the cold nights in the Gaitai. Maraming salamat po sa inyo. Maraming maraming salamat. Wala pong katumpasan saya namin. Next up was around the drop-off point of Mount Patulsong where an organized health center was leading the distribution of goods and the donations coming in. We were welcomed by Ate Vilma. Then and there, we turned over to her the goods like food, water, and hygiene kits while well, the clothes and jackets. Well, I decided to personally distribute them along with the blankets and the clothes to actually see what fits accordingly. Kuya Joel shared a few words of inspiration to them, a prayer of hope. Huwag mo sana tayong mawala ng tiwala, huwag mo sana tayong mawala ng pananampalataya sa ating Panginoon. Lagi po natin ibigay yung ating pananampalataya at pagtitiwala sa Diyos. Di po ba? Tama po ba? Okay. Yun lang po yung makakatulong sa atin bagamat may mga tao na tumutulong, pero higit sa lahat, may Diyos na hindi nang iibang sa atin. Um, isipin po natin lagi na kahit ganito po yung uh, nangyari sa atin, We had a quick lunch and then visited Banilad Elementary School. What welcomed us was a mountain of clothing donation with kids just playing it. An entertainment team was already doing their part for the day. 
But well, we didn't really donate anything but just checked out on them. Simple acts of hope, joy, and inspiration that's more than enough and a big help for all of those in the evacuation center. It was Barangay Kaibagal North in Amadeo, Cavite. There were 18 families welcoming us with their smiles despite the current situation. Upon the drop of goods, you can instantly see the smile in their faces. Finally was our last stop, back at the end of Palace in the Sky. Where Barangay Dap Dap West is, there we found Miss Cat who welcomed us and received the goods as it would be hard for our SUV to go out down to the community. To share some light in what only seemed to be a road with an unknown destination, but of course there is a reason to be grateful for life, a reason to not lose hope, and a tomorrow to keep looking forward to. And that within us all is a heart of a warrior.